are moving on. Small-scale traders along Ronald Ngala Street in Nairobi are decrying demolition of their shops and loss of property worth over 1.8 million shillings. They claim a tycoon used guns to bring down their shops in the middle of the night. Details of these and more in the county news briefs. A section of traders in Nairobi's central business district are counting losses after their shops were demolished on Tuesday night. The angry business persons are blaming a city tycoon for the damage. The Nairobi Metropolitan Services has distanced itself from the incident. Meanwhile, a family in Yamira County is seeking justice for their 14-year-old daughter who was allegedly impregnated by a 70-year-old man and abandoned. The man is said to have lured the minor with money when schools indefinitely closed in March last year due to COVID-19 pandemic. <laughs> And in Kirinyaga, police are holding a high school teacher after he attacked his colleague in the staff room with machete in a suspected love triangle. Moya East Sub-County Police Commandant Daniel Kitavi confirmed the incident took place at Karoti Girls School after the two disagreed over a female teacher recently posted to the school. Pamoja likuwa na mapenzi na na wiyo mwanadada ambayo ni intern katika hiyo shule. Kukato na panga, bada kupele kwa hospitali alikuwa admitted, manafukili sayi antubila tunaungia na nila na matibabu. Elsewhere, residents of Turkana County are set to benefit from health mobile clinics launched in the area by the regional government. Health CEC Jane Ajele says the project will ease the transportation burden on locals who have to travel for long distances in search of medical treatment. Tuweze kuwasaidia watu walikuwa napata matibabu kwa Kanam Sub County Hospital ambayo ilikuwa converted to COVID center na imekuwa registered. And Migori County Assembly Speaker Boaz Okoth wants the process of implementing the Building Bridges Initiative report hastened. Okoth says political rivalry is derailing handover of the Constitution Amendment Bill 2020 to Parliament. Uh, politics is our business. So if there are officers working within this county assembly that are being used by other politicians to malign the name of Migori County Assembly, then it is now administrative and will ask the speaker and his administration to take action. Irene Mchuma Odim, Channel 1.